my face by China Bear. I am here to bring you guys a fall shoe haul. Okay, that rhymes. Fall shoe haul. Hey. But I'm here to bring you guys a fall shoe haul. Um, I got a bunch of shoes. I, I just had this little shopping bug and I just went crazy. Got a bunch of shoes. I'm going to let you guys in on the plug. Now, with saying that, I cannot have you guys going to this website, buying up all the shoes, and when I want to go shopping, ain't no shoes left in my size. So y'all need to go, you know, have some, you know, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Some respect? Is that the word I'm looking for? Have some concern? Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Look out for me. Make sure y'all don't buy everything. I went to a website called shoeshow.com. This is not sponsored, you guys. This is not sponsored. I discovered this place a while ago when I went to go visit my sister in Ohio. And um, they had some really cute shoes in their store for really cheap. And then when I got home, I was like, we don't have that store here. So I was like, maybe they got a website. So I went online. They had a website. I've been buying from the website. Shipping is fast. Shipping is free. Where they do that at? Nowhere. The prices range. It all depends on what kind of shoes you're going to get. Um, They have basic shoes. They have playful shoes. They have name brand shoes. The name brand shoes, of course, are going to be more on a, a pricier side. Like, like, you know, like Nike and all the other brands. Those are going to be more on a pricier side. But if you're just looking for some fashion shoes or some orange trend shoes, you can get them for pretty cheap. Um, All the shoes that I got, I, I think I spent, I got nine pairs of shoes. I got them all for less than $100. Yeah. Like one pair of shoes I got for seven. So, yeah. I keep in mind, too, these are not like the top quality shoes, you know. Like, let's say Ferro 21, Rainbow type shoes. Like, is, is there not like some great quality shoes? Now, don't get me wrong, they're not horrible quality either, but they're not like some top quality not shoes. But look at the price, you know. You know, you get what you pay for. But I wanted to give you guys some information about them in case you wanted to get some of them. Some of them are better quality than others. Some of them I can't believe how cheap they were compared to the quality. Um, I got some thigh highs. Oh my god. Each fall I say, I'm going to get some thigh high boosters fall. I'm going to get some thigh high boosters fall. And I never get them. I never get them. And this year I'm like, no, I'm getting them this year. Because I always regret not getting them. So this year I said I'm going to get them. And I, while I was on the site, they had some on the site. And they had them for the low low. Y'all the low low. Oh god. Anyways, I don't want this intro to be too long. I want to get right into the shoes. So, like I said, I'm going to try on each pair that you guys see what they look like, tell you the price, tell you how they fit, um, all that good stuff. So, and I will link them down below in the description bar for you less as well. Um, if you have any qu questions about shipping and where they ship to, I don't know. Go to the website. Go. Ch I don't work for them. This is not sponsored. I just bought some shoes from their website. So, go to the website. I'll have it down below in the description bar. Thumbs up this video, you guys, right now. Stop what you're doing. Thumbs up this video. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. If you're not getting notifications when I put up a video, go down below, buy my username. You'll see Black China Bear. And right next to my name, you'll see a bell. Click on that bell, and then YouTube will notify you when I put up new videos. So, like the video, subscribe, click the bell next to my username. If you're already subscribed, make sure you click that bell if you haven't already did so, so that way you always get notified when I put up new videos. So without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Oh guys, and yes, there is a tutorial for this makeup look and this hair. Yes, I got you guys covered. Okay, I love you guys. Mwah. Bye! Okay guys, so we're jumping into the first pair of shoes. If you see mess everywhere, I just got them recording five videos, so there is stuff everywhere. Just ignore it because I have to do a massive cleaning once I get done with this video. Anyway, so this is the first pair of shoes. These are some stone wash thigh high boots. These are called Kimberly. I have them in a 12 medium. I normally wear an 11, but I was ordering online, so I got a 12 because I was nervous. Honestly, the 12 is fitting just fine, so it's not a problem for me. I was worried that they wouldn't fit, but they fit great. And... As you guys can see, I can pull these up, and I have really big thighs. So if you're plus size, you can rock these. If you're not plus size, you'll probably be able to pull them up even higher, because there is some um, more material down here. I absolutely love these. Um, these shoes, the heel is thick, but I think it's about either three or four inches long. Um, this definitely needs a pad right here. I'm going to buy some of those Dr. Show things and get a pad right here, because there's no padding at all in this shoe, so... All that pressure is on the, the ball of my foot, and that's a lot of pressure. Um, these zip on the side. As you guys can see in the front, it is a peephole toe. And I love the fringe detailing they have all around here. These are really, really cute. And I got these for $11. $11. The 
mature, okay? Are y'all seeing this? Are you seeing this? Okay, so these are, these are called Fusion, and I have the color Olive. And these do come in different colors. I saw like a dark red, like maybe like a burgundy, a black. I have the size 11M, and the heel is about, I want to say maybe 4 inches, 3 or 4 inches. The box says $15. And these are like a material, like a cloth material. As you guys can see, that you can roll it down. It's like a sock. It's very, very stretchy. Now, I noticed that when I wear them on my bare skin, they don't stay all the way up. So, um, it would probably be better if you have pants on underneath this so they have something to grab onto. And then also, like, if you're plus size like me, like I said, you probably would want to get something to pit down here. It's kind of a pad to pit down here so that way you have better um, comfort in wearing the shoes. These are the next pair of shoes. Hopefully, you guys can see them better. I did it close up so that hopefully you can see them better. Now, I know these are not going to be everybody's cup of tea. It took a while for them to grow on me. I would see them all the time in the stores. And the style of the shoe took a long time to grow on me. But now I absolutely adore them, love them, cannot wait to style them. I know, like, right now, it's like, what the heck are those? But what do you see how I style these shoes? So they're, they're gold and they're a snake print print <laughs> and then the bottom part is like a cream it has cream trimming and they're so freaking adorable it just remind me of wing tips or maybe they are wing tips i don't know but i just uh i'm over the moon about these shoes and they are so comfortable i was afraid they weren't going to um fit because of the whiff like, I have wide feet, but they fit very comfortably. They were originally $29, and I got them for 7 These were the $7 shoes, you guys. These are called Unique. They would be called that. I got them in a 12M. I normally wear an 11, but these do run small. Probably because the toe is pointed, so I would definitely size up in these shoes. Because the 12 is fitting perfectly with these shoes for me. Okay, on to the next one, you guys. This is the next pair. I know I went thigh high crazy, you guys. So I'm not going to lie. A lot of these shoes are thigh high. Because <laughs> I had to get some, and they were so cheap, I couldn't resist it. So these are some black ones. They're like a full, what do you call this material? Suede? It's like a full suede material. They zip up on the side, and then they tie up in the back right here. The heel is not too high. They're very, very comfortable, you guys. Like, I don't know if there's some padding on the bottom of these or what, but they're so comfortable. The heel is not too hard where I can't walk comfortably in them and wear them for hours. Like, they are just... <sighs> I love these shoes. I love them. These are called Gorgeous. I have them in the color black. I bought these in a 12 wide. Thank God I did. Um, they were originally $40, and I got them for $16.97. And then I also got these same boots in a different color. I got them in the color, I think it's taupe. And um, the style is also called Gorgies. These ones were on sale for $9.97. Um, the only thing with these is I got these in a 12 medium, or 12M, which I think, I think it stands for medium. Um, I wish they would have came in the wide. I can still fit them. It's just, it's a little bit more restrictive. The restriction comes from this little band right here. It's a band right here. And this thing is so tight on the leg. So I have to like pull it over my leg, like over my calf. Um, like this part right here where the calf curves. And then sometimes when it gets up here, it's fine. But when I have to pull it down back over that part of my calf, oh my God, I think it's like stuck. Because I want to show you this boot. This one is tighter on my foot right here. This one is just plain old comfortable, no problem. Um, and this, as you guys can see, this line right here is making it hard to pull it up. So it's sort of just stuck. Now this one, you see that? It just glides right up. So there is a difference when it comes to the width of these boots. 
Now I can I can pull it up. I have to struggle to get it past this part of my calf because you guys can see it's stuck right here. So I can get it up, but when I when I get it off, it's hard. So I'm not gonna pull those up all the way, but I just want to show you guys what they look like in case you wanted to see. The next ones are these. These come in this color, which is tan, or is it camel? No, it's tan. So they come in this color, which is tan. They also come in the color black. I've been seeing these shoes for like years on like the Asian websites like AliExpress and Rose Gale and all that other stuff. But I never see them in my size. So when I saw them on the website, honey, I was I had to get these. I read the reviews. The reviews were saying that they run small. So I ordered one size up and I ordered the 12s. The 12s came and they were tight. They were tight boo-boos. And my mom saw them. She's like, I'm going to order me some. So I was like, hey, you take these because she's like, a, like one size smaller than me. So she's taking these and I ordered another pair. So these are the 13s. A 13, you guys. Wow. I'm surprised that I had to order such a big size for them to fit, but they do fit comfortably now. So these are a size 13. Um, this is a loose fur material. And it, it comes in sheets. Like these are like little sheets of fur. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's so cute. Like I said, they come in black. Um, these were only $12.98. And these are called Alaska. They were originally $24.99. And I have them in a size 13M like Mary. These do not come in wide sizes. Um, even though these are a 13M, they are still wide because these type of boots normally run, run wide because they're like snow boots. So they do have um, a lining on the inside. Something on the inside to make them feel a little bit warmer. But like that rubber, regular snow boot material. And then it has the ridged bottom. They have grip on them as well. Like they're not slippery, thank God. I hate when they're slippery on the bottom. But they're only $12.98. You can't beat that. The next pair of shoes are these right here. They're called Starry. I have them in 11M. I would have got them in a wide, but they don't come in a wide. They were originally $40, and I got them for $9. These shoes are the bomb. They're rose gold. My lighting is just killing me today. So they're rose gold. The heel is full of rose gold glitter. It's a thick... Um, I forgot what this is called, but it has uh, rose gold glitter stars all over the shoe. Like, they're freaking adorable, and I hope my camera is picking them up for you guys so you can see the quality of them. They are so freaking cute. I love them so much, I got them in black as well. They come in rose gold, and they come in black. My only problem, well, I have two, I have a couple problems with these shoes. The biggest problem that I have is the zipper. The zipper in the back is horrendous. They are so hard to zip up. When you're not wearing them, they're hard to zip up. When you're wearing them, <laughs> they're hard to zip up. So right now, I have one shoe zipped and one shoe unzipped. Uh, it is so hard to zip these shoes. I don't know why it's so stiff in the back. But when I first pulled them out the box, like whenever I have a zipper on a shoe, I always test the zipper to see how it is. It was so stiff and so hard to zip. Um, but I was like, they're so freaking cute. And I got the black ones, and the black ones were giving me the same problem, except the black ones was more difficult because the black ones keep eating the fold of material that's by the zipper. And I'll show you that when I try those on. Um, but they're so cute, and they're only $9. So that's the first gripe. The second gripe is when you buy shoes like this, of course you've got to be concerned with this part right here because it will pinch your toes. So that's a concern. And then, of course, they need padding on the ball of your foot. Cause there's no padding in these shoes but other than that for nine dollars honey can i really complain can i really complain i, I didn't pay forty dollars for them you know i paid nine dollars and they're freaking stunning so guys i want to show you what the black one looks like and this is what she looks like she also has that black glitter in the heel and this is the zipper in the back like you really have to fight this thing to get it down um the black ones the problem i have with this one is this little flap of material right here it keeps getting sucked into the zipper so i'm going to cut this out 
even with that being folded back the zipper is still pretty stiff i think i'm just going to keep going up and down on these shoes until it loosens up but they're so cute and they're only nine dollars So dolls, the last pair of shoes I want to show you are these right here. These are called Nakisha. I have them in a size 12M like Mary. And I got them for $9. The heel is about 4 inches. They zip on the side and they lace up in the front. They have like an embroidery detailing all over them including on the heel. They are just so freaking bomb. They are stunning. They are eye-catching. Like, when I saw them on the website, I was like, no, yes, no, yes. I was like, I cannot let them go. I love them. I think they are just eye-catching. They're so different, so unique, so beautiful. Like, oh my gosh, I cannot. Now, these shoes, like I said, they're an M, but these are wide. And I have them on, and my feet still have room, like... They're wide shoes, so if you have wide feet, they are wide feet friendly. And I know I'm showing you guys a lot of heels in this video. I don't know what happened. I just bought a lot of heels. And I haven't really worn heels in a long time. Like, I wear them. I used to wear them all the time, but, you know, with weight gain, you're like, oh, no, I don't want no heels. But <laughs> I just went heel crazy. But they do have flats on the website. They have flat boots, flat shoes. Yeah, anyways, but these shoes are really, really cute. They definitely need some padding in the front like all heels um but they're just so cute they're so freaking cute but like, i love them i love them and nine dollars how could i walk away how could i walk away sway how how so this is the last pair i will have links to all the shoes down below thank you guys for watching make sure to thumbs up this video like i said earlier and i will catch you guys in the next video bye